Hello everyone, I hope you're having an amazing day. So today we're gonna open this triple beats Japanese booster box. I'm so excited. We know the quality of the Japanese um, Pokemon cards is a lot better than the English one. And I want to know if the Japanese version of the set has better pull rates than the English one because honestly, Paldea Evolved and Scarlet and Violet have been a mess for me personally to try and get something good apart from those like loose packets we have which was extremely lucky but I want to know if we're going to be luckier with the Japanese version. Even if we're not, it doesn't matter. These cards are absolutely stunning. I love the quality of Japanese cards so I'm sure it's going to be a pleasure to open this pack. So yeah, let's get into it. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ellie and I'm gonna put a playlist of more Japanese Pokemon cards at the end of this video. If you're not new here, hello, welcome back. And here we have our beautiful Triple Beat. I hope I'm saying it correctly. Triple Triple Beat um, Booster Box. I am so excited to get into this. Like I said, the quality of Japanese Pokemon cards is just so much better than the English one. I honestly wish that they made the English cards with the same quality as the Japanese ones, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Here are the packets. How many packets do we actually have? I don't even know. So we have 30 booster packs. However, each booster pack comes with only five cards. Now, I don't know if this makes our odds better or worse. I have no idea, but we shall see. Can we, are we ready for this? Can we get some first pack magic? Can we start this opening with something really, really good? What do you guys think? Do you think we're gonna get something here? Do you think, I, it would be nice, you know, just to keep the tradition, the tradition of the first pack magic, it would be really, really nice, but I might use some scissors as well, because I don't know why. I feel like these packs are a little bit harder to open. All right, so first pack, First pack magic, guys. Also, it's so weird that it's just five cards. It's really, really weird. Right, all right. I don't remember anyone's names. Oricorio, that's the only one I can remember. No, we don't get any first pack magic. It's so weird that it's just five cards. I'm gonna try to stop saying that because I feel like it's gonna be annoying if I just keep mentioning it. So I will try. I might get my scissors. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna open these packets with some scissors because I feel like otherwise I'm just gonna end up damaging the cards because I can't open them properly. They're so glued in. Quaxley, I forgot his name. Little Leo, come on. Phalanx, come on. Still nothing. One of the most expensive cards from this set is her, which I can't remember her name. It's gonna be on the screen, but she's the chase card for the set, I guess, the most expensive card. So I'm not thinking we're gonna pull that, but just just an FYY, a little bit of information in case you guys wanted to know. Why not put the scissors off screen? Just, I don't know if YouTube is gonna flag me for showing scissors, but might as well. Float cell. Whopper. I'm trying to remember everyone's names. It's a challenge. Larvesta. Oh, oh, it is it up for first pull. Yes, it is our first pull. Finally. I mean, not finally. It's like our third packet, but we do get something. It's an art rare and it looks so, 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 so cool. Oh, and a Pantheon Tarot Taurus. I don't even know. Slave it time, slave it time, slave it, slave it time. I love how all the um, starters have the evolution line telling a story. I find that so, so, so cute. It is really, really cute. Hopefully we manage to get the full evolution of Quaxley, but we have the middle one at least, so that's something. Cutting off camera, not showing the scissors. Oops. I actually don't know if, if I can show them or not. Oh, Spoink! I didn't know Spoink was on this set, actually. Was Spoink in the English version? I'm actually not sure. Comment down below if you know about that, because I don't know. Um, Sprigatito, Salen, is it Salendite? Got something, no. Did we get something? No. Did we get some, oh no, it's the last card, Never mind. Cut, 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 cut. Here we go. I don't know if I like that it's just five cards. Is that normal for Japanese cards? We haven't opened many Japanese cards on the set, so I actually have no clue. It just feels weird that it's just five cards. I don't know. A little again. This guy, I can't remember his name. 
Ooh, I love her or him. But I, I just love this evolution line. <gasps> Ooh, we're getting something. It's an EX. It's a Lycan Rock EX. We got something. And behind it is this spawning guy. I don't know how you're called. But look at that. We got something. Sleeve it down, sleeve it down. Sleeve it, sleeve it down. All right, we got two pulls so far. So that's not so bad, is it? We got four booster, four boosters, two pulls. So that's one pull for each two boosters. I think that's better odds than the English one, but we're gonna wait because things can still change. Let's see. All right, don't know your name. Dano, don't know your name either. That's fine. Can't remember anyone's name. Stellybird. Is that something? Paul Dian Taros. And the energy retrieval. I feel like anything after Gen 1, I just cannot remember the names. I just cannot. I'm sorry. Uh, Wattbird, Kilowatt Bird. I don't know. I'm just gonna say whatever name I don't remember, I'm just gonna invent a new name. Um, Tropios. It's actually the same name as the Japanese. Cool. I didn't know. Um, Mistinkaton. Don't know. Can't remember her name. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. The Tropios. Oh, he's beautiful. Look at that. I didn't know this card was in his. I didn't know this card existed. Do we have this card in the English yet? And I just had no idea about it. Possibly. But it is beautiful. <gasps> it is beautiful. Slip the time, slip the time, slip the slip the time. It is so pretty though. Oh, I'm so happy already. I'm really, really happy. That's one of the loveliest um, art rares that I've seen in a while, like illustration cards. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy with that. All right, Buzio. Oh, our lovely Fue Coco. I really didn't know he was on the set. It's really weird. <gasps> Are we gonna get something? Are we gonna get. <gasps> no, no, we did not. No, we did not. No, we did not pull this. Is this not. Is this. Is this. Is this. Is it. I. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I'm. What? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> sleepy time. Sleepy time. Sleepy, sleepy time. Did I? I need a second. <laughs> did I? What? Did I? No, did I? <laughs> I thought I was going crazy, but yeah, we just pulled the most expensive card of this set. I, I come, I had this box sitting on my desk for like two weeks and I did not touch it. And I was just sitting on the most expensive card of the set. Okay, uh, that's it. There's no way we can put anything else. There, uh, mm, there's no way we can put anything else more epic. This is a really disappointing opening because this is it. We're not going to pull anything better than this. What the hell, guys? We've just pulled the most expensive card of the set. I'm... Uh... I was joking about how uh, there's no way we're gonna pull the most expensive card of the set. I'm already not even thinking about it. <laughs> well then, let's keep going. I could not believe, I could not believe just happened. Did you guys, I, I don't know what's going on. My personal life is a shambles right now, but at least I'm lucky pulling cards, I guess. There's a silver lining. I cannot believe that happened. What the heck? Um, cool. I don't know what else to look for. I don't even care. I'm so sorry. This is a very disappointing opening because at this point, we've pulled two beautiful art rares and we've pulled whatever her name is that I can't remember. That's it. We're happy. What the hell? Everything's falling now. All right, let me try to chill and see what else we can get from this amazing box. Honestly, I cannot ask for anything right now. I will not ask for anything because there's no way we can get anything more epic than that. Like, there's no way. 
Well, the next most expensive kind of the set is the Meows Karada and the other version of Dendra. Those are the next two most expensive ones, but I don't think, I don't think it will happen. Um, but anyways, just to keep you guys informed, I guess. Um, Lily, yo, um, I don't, I don't even know your name. I'm sorry, uh, Quaxwell. I'm scared. <laughs> oh, it's a hollow. I didn't notice it was a hollow. Hello. It's very stylish. I don't know who you are, but you're very stylish. <laughs> Alrighty then. I don't know what else to say. I'm sorry for my lack of commentary. This is a beautiful Vulcan. Vul is it Vulcan Roa? I think it's Vulcan Roa. Something moss in Japanese. I don't know. Um, Sprigatito, um, Rockruff, I am scared of this booster box, I am very scared. We weren't even halfway, like, I feel like this is highly disappointing for you guys watching at home because I, I don't know what else we can get from this box, I don't know, but I'm personally excited to see what else we're gonna get from here. Alright, oh, ah. Uh, I think it's just a regular EX. Chill. Chill, everyone. Chill, everyone. It is just an EX. Just. Let's live it down. Let's live it down. Let's live it down. Like I said, my personal life. Yeah. Not doing so great, but at least I'm lucky pulling Pokemon cards. All right. Nimbug. I think that's his name. I don't know. Vulcan, no, Larvesta. Why was I gonna call you Larvesta? Vul I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> the silence. The silence now of not knowing what to say because there's nothing that I can possibly say that is gonna be more interesting than pulling that card. Anyways, Delibird. Oh, geez. Um, you again. Tropius again. Floatzel. my girl <laughs> all right this is the last packet of the first half let's see what i can get from here um god knows what's your name i don't know um birdie wordy the links i'm scared oh uh ninja bug and uh pyro uh, can we get a first pack of the second half magic? <laughs> uh, can can we get it? Can we can we get it? No, I. You know what? I'm I'm happy with what we pulled. Maybe one or another art rare, and I'd be like super happy. But I'm already I'm already happy. I can't I can't complain. Um, I think this is another illustration. I think we got this Pokemon, but in a different illustration. Maybe I'm just high, but. I don't know. Makuhita, one of my favorite fighting types. Uh, professor, I don't even know. Taurus. Oh, that was it. No first pack magic. <laughs> no first pack magic on uh, this side. Did you think all the heat was on the first half? Do you think that was it and we're not gonna find anything else? The magic carp. I think there's a cool magic carp as well um, on this set. I think it's on this set, but I can't. I can't remember. Like I said, I had this box sitting on my desk for like two weeks, so I forgot which cards are part of the set. I can't remember because, um, yeah, it's been a while. Uh, Diglett. <laughs> Dang it, Dawn. Yeah. Love her. Love her so much. I also love Corviknight, which is, um, if you know the lore, um, yeah, it's it's weird to, to like both of these Pokemons. I don't know if I could have both of them on my party, but... It is what it is. Anyways, uh, did I see something? I possibly saw something at the back. I, I possibly spoiled myself. Let's see. Um, is there something? That, no. Oh, oh, it was a sable. <laughs> it was a mix of emotions because it's just a, ho a hollow. I, I saw shiny, so I thought it was something, but it was just a hollow. However, it's Sableye, one of my favorite Pokemons. I like him so much. I couldn't have him in real life because I, I don't have money to buy 
um, precious stones to feed it. But I love him anyways. He's so cute. And you don't see him so often, actually. Oh, I don't think we had the fire version. Um, you don't see Sable Eye so often on, on the trading card game. So uh, I would like to buy a few Sable Eye cards. I don't even think there's that many, actually. Anyways. Oh, Vulcan Roa. Phalinx again. I hate this Pokemon. This guy that I can't remember his name, a cool stadium, and this gangster looking guy. I'm gonna call him Gangster Ferret. Gangster Boss Ferret, and then the other one's gonna be Gangster Ferret. Actually, I changed my mind. Anyways, Fui Coco, a Diglett. I think this is, maybe it's just a hollow. Do you think it's just a hollow? No. What is this? Oh. Oh, I thought I thought we were gonna get a repeat. I was so upset for like half a second because I thought, please don't give me a repeat. But no, it's the Quaxley. So it's the first one on. Oh, please, yes. Uh, stop pulling attention on yourself. We know you're here. Um, it is the first on the evolution line. See what you mean? See what I mean? Like it's like he's been growing up in the same house, and he's just like growing up and changing his hair. It is so cool. It's such a cool detail that it did that. That you know. Like a little Pokemon growing up in his childhood home. So nice. Sleep it time, sleep it time, sleep, sleep it time. I find it really, really cute when cards just tell a story like that. Um, it's the reason why I collect Pokemon cards, is for the artworks. So I love when they make little details like this. It's, it's cute. Anyways, moving on. Salonite, for Kuku, Makuhira. I didn't think there was gonna be anything. I didn't think there was gonna be um, two pulls, one after each other, which I I think we cracked it. I think there is one pack with the pull and one pack without. So by that logic, this should have something, but let's see. Delibird, Sprigatito, still can't remember your name. There is some, you th do you think I'm right? Do you think I'm right? Might be. Meowskarada EX. It is not the like super fancy one. However, it is really, really cute. It is really, really nice. Sleep the time, sleep the time, sleep the sleep the time. I actually can't remember if we did the sleepy time with the quack sleep, but it's fine. All right, so by my calculations, this one should be without a pull. Let's see. Uh, Arresta, Quaxley, Mushroomy. There you go. Well, it is a hollow, so I don't know if it is classified as a pool or not. You let me know. And uh, an energy. And by the logic, this one should have a pool. Do you think it's actually like that? Like, do you think it's actually working this way? That is one pool, one without, one pool, one without. Hmm. You tell me your experiences if you have opened this um, set at home. What do you guys think? Oh, see, no, it isn't because we should have had something in this one and we didn't. So it doesn't always work like that. We are almost done. It's gone so fast because there's just five cards, which is really weird. You knew I was going to mention it again. Um, so it's it's gone quite quick. Ooh, Aranguru, we haven't had this one yet. Um, but you know what? I feel like sometimes opening a whole booster box just becomes so... Um, so long, you know, so it's actually quite a nice to make a faster video like this. Also for you guys at home, if you're watching, it might get a little bit boring to see the same regular. Oh, ooh, why do I forgot your name? <laughs> why do I forgot his name? I genuinely forgot his name, but it is a pull. It's an EX. We got the Miascarada and then we got him. We're just missing the Quaquaval and we have the three starters in the ex which would be really really cool it's so cool oh we didn't do the no no absolutely not sleep it time sleep it time sleep it time did i just remove the card out of the sleeve to put it back just so we could sing the single absolutely absolutely i did i am sorry if that was cringy please don't unsubscribe please don't leave the video for that um, I had to, I'm sorry, but I, I had to do it. Anyways, is there something in here? I think it's gonna be just a hollow, right? Yeah, I had the feeling it was just a hollow. 
I don't know why. Oh, we have three packs left. That's it, three left. Do you think we're still gonna pull some heat? I would love to have another illustration, that's it. Just, I would love to have the um, Quaquaval just to complete the evolution line, but I don't know, I don't know if it's gonna be possible. What do you guys think? Place your bets right now, goodbye for Coco. <laughs> Place your bets right now, what do you think we're still gonna pull? If we're still gonna manage to pull anything. All right, second to last pack. Can we get some second to last pack magic? Second to last pack magic. Can we get? Oh, can we get something? Well, clearly no. I've just ruined that. That was very anticlimactic. However, we do have the last pack. So, last pack magic. Do you feel it? Do you feel like that there's something in here? I'm trying not to spoil anyone. Do you feel like there's something in here? A little, little last pack magic action. Thank you guys for watching, by the way. Um, yeah, the playlist will be at the end. Let me know if you wanna see more Japanese card videos. And let's see if we get something for our last pack magic. Just an Oranguru. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I honestly don't know what to say uh, that, uh, yeah, exactly. You saw my reaction. There's no more words. I don't need to say anything else. I hope you have an amazing day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.